Hey, Radical fans, today's Radical Rundown, a question came in about drill angle. Does it matter? Well, in one ball it does, in one ball it doesn't. So the drill angle does not matter when it comes to the um, symmetrical ball. Uh, the CG, as long as you keep it under three ounces, you fall under the legal limits of the USB-C, and that drill angle is really not going to matter what it is whatsoever. It's pin to pap distance that we concern about and the VAL angle. Uh, on the other hand, when you look at a symmetrical, an asymmetrical ball, an asymmetrical ball like the outer limits, the drill angle does matter because you're dealing with a mass bias. And that's the, the intermediate diff is where that's impacted. Um, so you have two angles to worry about, a drill angle and a VAL angle. The drill angle does not matter on symmetrical balls, but matters very much on asymmetrical balls. Um, the drill angle can be used to fine tune the ball motion. You need to pay attention to that. Um, lay it out relative to your style and what your ball motion wants. We have great drill sheets in the box that'll help you determine the ball motion you're going to get, and it does list the angles um, at the reference. But in the case of a symmetrical ball, does not matter. Neither does a CG. So many people have asked about uh, when you drill a symmetrical ball, after drilling it becomes somewhat asymmetrical ball. Uh, it does. You know, you change the, in, the shape of the core, it's no longer symmetrical because you put holes in it. But what we know, and we do know from scientific tests and, and all of the things we do here, is that the preferred spin axis always ends up in a thumb hole on a symmetrical ball. It, it ends up in the biggest hole. Um, when, in the days before the rule where we could put balance holes in it, sometimes it would end up somewhere between the two because of the influence of the second hole. Since we can't use balance holes anymore, the preferred spin axis always ends up in the thumb hole. So that's not as much of an issue. Again, with this one, it absolutely pertains to uh, the drill angle and the VAL. So, and that's today's Radical Rundown. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below and we'll be happy to, to look at them, maybe get back to you on them. We'll see you the next Radical Rundown.